I get distracted sometimes when I look at your face. I get that a lot. You know why? Because I'm beautiful. No. Because of the, the little freaking white hairs you've got there. They're not gray. You've had them forever. But that, that little birthmarky white hair thing is always like calling to me. It's like little fingers going, stare at me. Please don't talk about my hair. <laughs> Back to our stupid reacts with the idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter. It's juicy. It's tweeting. It's, it's juicy. Tweeting everywhere I go. And thank you for watching Patreon. Follow us on official Twitter. Account. Yes, thank you, Patreons. We yes. appreciate it. We don't thank you very much. much. We really mean it. Uh, today we are reacting to a Sri Devi. <gasps> it's not. It's a. I don't care. Biography. I, awesome! So it's a it's a little thing. Have you? It's a short video to uh, help us get to know her career a little better. Have you watched anything about her yet, as far as her biography? I I have mm -hmm. way back when we first got introduced to her. Um, somebody sent me a. It was something I didn't think we would react to. It was a long biography about Sri Devi. I can't not watch everything that comes out of India. Yes. No. You can. No. Do you know what your channel is? Yes. Okay. Then it's stop watching stuff. I guarantee this isn't the same thing. It's like, okay, should I not read books on Satyajit Ray because we're going to watch his films and stuff You can read a book. About... Stop watching the videos. <sighs> They're going to be I'm very mad at you. I haven't seen this. You don't know if you have I seen guarantee it. I haven't seen this. But I'm excited because I know a little bit about her. Here we go. And she's freaking awesome. <laughs> जिनका नाम रखा गया था श्री अम्मा यांगर आयप्पन जन्म 13 अगस्त सन 1963 में हुआ हां हां सुन रही हूं मैं नहीं हूं तू चाहती क्या है श्री देवी का जन्म तमिलनाडु के शिवाकाशी नगरी में हुआ मां राजेश्वरी जो कि तेलुगु रही और पिता आयप्पन जो कि तमिल भाषी थे इनके पिता एक वकील थे इनकी एक बहन है और दो सौतेले भाई ये देखिए कब मुझे कॉलेज के फैंसी ड्रेस कंपटीशन में फर्स्ट प्राइज मिला है वाह 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 मुबारक हो श्री देवी ने बचपन में ही अपने एक्टिंग करियर की शुरुआत कर दी थी तमिल फिल्म थी पुनाई बन हमको पता चल गया तुम कौन में कौन सा नौकरी करने गया था और 1971 की फिल्म पूम बाटा में बेबी श्री देवी के अभिनय की खूब सराहना हुई थी इस मलयालम फिल्म के लिए उसके बाद ये एक-एक करके और भी फिल्मों में काम करती रहीं सिर्फ दक्षिण भारतीय फिल्मों में ही इन्होंने काम नहीं किया बल्कि हिंदी फिल्म जूली में भी ये बतौर चाइल्ड आर्टिस्ट नजर आई थी बहुत छोटी ही थी कि महान निर्देशक के बालाचंदर ने इनका जीवन पूरी तरह से बदल के रख दिया। श्रीदेवी को तमिल फिल्म मुंद्रु मुदिचु में एक जबरदस्त रोल दिया और इस रोल में इनके सामने थे दो बड़े ही जबरदस्त एक्टर्स कमल हासन और रजनीकांत। हे, यू नो बोथ देम। बात करो, ये इन्होंने सिर्फ मलयालम तमिल और तेलुगु फिल्मों में ही काम नहीं किया बल्कि कन्नड़ा फिल्मों में भी अपने अभिनय के जौहर दिखाए इनके नृत्य की जितनी सराहना की गई उतनी ही सराहना इनके अभिनय की भी की गई कर रहे हैं तो कभी भूल कभी मेरे सामने इसके बिना मत कीजिएगा कमल हासन के साथ इनकी फिल्म सदमा को कौन भूल सकता है एक बार कम गुसरी हुई बातों को भूल जाओ तमिल और तेलुगु सिनेमा में बतौर हीरोइन काम करने के बाद इन्होंने हिंदी फिल्मों की तरफ रुख उसके बाद जितेंद्र साहब के साथ आई फिल्म हिम्मतवारा ने बॉक्स ऑफिस पे हंगामा मचा दिया। न तो मवाली रही या फिर तोफा, कर्मा रही या फिर मिस्टर इंडिया, या फिर चाल बाज़ अलम हैं। हर फिल्म के साथ इनके अभिनय की परिपक्वता सामने आती गई। चल रहे हैं। 
अपनों को सेंगी लगाता है अरे अपने को ऊपर वाले ने दो फीट का सेंगी दिया है श्री देवी ने हर तरह का किरदार निभाया चाहे वो ग्लैमरस रहा या फिर बिना मेकअप का एक ऐसा समय आ गया था जब इनके आस कोई दूसरी हीरोइन भी नहीं थी उनका फिल्म करियर परवान चल रहा था बड़े से बड़ा सितारा इनके साथ काम कर रहा था चाहे वो अनिल कपूर रहे या फिर अमिताभ बच्चन कमल हसन रहे या फिर रजनीकांत जितेंद्र रहे या फिर सनी देओल सभी के साथ श्रीदेवी की जोड़ी रिकॉर्ड पर रिकॉर्ड बना रही थी और फिर इनके जीवन में एक ऐसा परिवर्तन आया जो हर नारी की जिंदगी में आता है श्रीदेवी ने शादी कर ली शादी की बोनी कपूर से बोनी कपूर जो कि एक जाने माने फिल्म प्रोड्यूसर हैं, तकलीफ ये थी कि बोनी कपूर साहब की शादी पहले हो चुकी थी और उनके oh. बच्चे भी थे एक शादीशुदा आदमी के साथ इनकी शादी का होना अपने आप में एक कठिन बात साबित हो रही थी पर यह हुआ बोनी कपूर अपने परिवार से अलग हुए और श्रीदेवी के साथ अपना दूसरा घर बसाया इस नाते से फिल्म इंडस्ट्री में श्रीदेवी अर्जुन कपूर की सौतेली माँ हुई तुमसे किसने कहा शादी के बाद ये फिल्मों से कुछ बरस दूर हो गयी इस शादी से इन्हें दो बेटियाँ हुई बड़ी बेटी जानवी और छोटी खुशी तकरीबन छह बरस सिल्वर स्क्रीन से दूर रहने के बाद श्रीदेवी ने दोबारा एक छोटी सी शुरुआत की और इस बार ये पिक्चर हॉल में नहीं घर के टीवी स्क्रीन पर नजर आई सीरियल का नाम था माननी अयर साल 2004। हजार चार रियलिटी शो में बतौर जज भी ये नजर आई पर बहुत दिनों तक इन्हें फिल्मों से दूर नहीं रखा जा सका दो के बाद कुछ बरस का इंतजार किया गया और फिर इंग्लिश विंग्लिश नाम की इस फिल्म में श्रीदेवी दोबारा नजर आई और इन्होंने वही किया जो एक अभिनेत्री करती है साबित कर दिया कि क्यों इन्हें इंडस्ट्री की सबसे जबरदस्त हीरोइंस में से एक माना गया अपने पूरे परिवार के साथ ये मीडिया के सामने आती रहीं। मीडिया के सवालों के जवाब भी दिए और यहाँ तक कह दिया की जब इंग्लिश विंग्लिश की शूटिंग शुरू हुई तब इन्हें लगा की ये एकदम नई और कोरी अभिनेत्री है श्रीदेवी को कई अवार्ड से नवाजा गया और इन अवार्ड्स की फहरिस्त वाकई बहुत लंबी है ये उन गिनी चुनी अभिनेत्रियों में से हैं जिन्होंने भारतीय सिनेमा के ब्लैक एंड व्हाइट दौर में काम किया बतौर चाइल्ड आर्टिस्ट शुरुआत की और अलग अलग भाषाओं में बतौर हीरोइन आई और हर क्षेत्र में अपना एक अलग मकाम बनाया भारतीय सिनेमा के इतिहास में श्रीदेवी का नाम हमेशा गर्व ऐसी लिया जाएगा It gave us like her resume and stuff, but what it didn't give us is the full orb of her artistic prowess. Mm -hmm. um, there was nothing in there about her capabilities in comedy, both physical and small. Mm -hmm. um, nothing really in there in her prowess as a dancer. Um, because I remember what what I saw and I've heard from comments from stupid babies about her is that she was. The, the absolutely w more than just what we call the triple threat yeah in which the triple threat can act sing and dance that she could do everything she could do comedy as well as she did drama she could do s dancing uh, as well as she did physical comedy versus nuanced small high brow dry comedy that she was a beauty but she could also play someone who wasn't relying on physical appearance to be attractive that she basically could do and be anything you needed her to be on screen and do it at the top of the level it could be done. Yeah. Um, you know, like for example, somebody who could do that was Lucille Ball, but most people know her just from her comedies and I Love Lucy, but Lucille Ball started off as a serious actress who could sing and who could dance, but Sri Devi was like the, the perfect female actor, pretty yeah. much. And this really didn't capture that. Yeah, it was it was more resume. Yeah, it was more resume, and even then, it didn't well, cover it, the resume. It, I mean, it is a short biography, so it only yeah. has six minutes. True. Uh, to kind of get into it, so I kind of just went over her highlights and then her family background. Yeah, which, which was I didn't, I didn't know. know. That was uh, nice. I didn't she, know that she, her husband was married. That I didn't know. Which I want to know what that means. Like, was he really married and living with her and married her anyway, or was he in the middle of a divorce and it takes like. 
eight months for the divorce to be finalized yeah. and he married her before the papers were done. That's because that's a, that's totally different yeah. than I'm married and I'm going to go marry someone else while I'm still married. Yeah. So what's up with that? Uh, and I believe it said she's Arjun Kapoor's Arjun Kapoor's stepmother. stepmother, I think. I, I believe that's Is that the right? Name. I believe that's the name I saw. Me too. Uh, we know him. We um, get really... There's a lot of Kapoor names in the industry, so we... I know it was Shahid. We know who his yeah, we know, is. We, know, <laughs> we, know, we now know that's that stepmom. Boy, is that a powerhouse of acting. Uh, the, they, I went in and looked at the comments on that, and virtually every comment oh, yeah. was that. Just boom, 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 boom. So immediately, if we don't know somebody, or yeah. if, we, if we didn't talk about a person <laughs> enough, it's over. It's, it's, just, that's all the comments. We are right lambasted. Like, but I found out from you, you sent me the text of the oh, picture of them. I, I saw it on Patreon because everything's on Patreon before. Thank you so much, Patreon. Yeah, if you didn't know that about Patreon, if you contribute to Patreon, everything that goes on the channel goes on Patreon and sometimes stuff that never makes the channel goes on Patreon if it was yeah. blocked. Uh, uh, but they, they can comment on stuff first and right. so I see their comments and so I was like oh boy I can tell this is going to be one of those things and so we figured out in the Ram Leela review that <laughs> he also is able to read correct me if I'm wrong you can read some more detailed feedback about requests mm -hmm. on Patreon yes yeah uh, um, but yeah also I want to know what because we've only seen one film of hers we've seen some uh, of her songs of her, her songs uh, and highlights blah 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 but what should the next film of hers be I know Mom was a, one Mom. of our recent ones that was her last film wasn't uh, it, it uh, yes. Because I remember we were talking about English of English, and I mistakenly thought it was her last film, and I think people said no, it was Mom. Yeah, Mom came out after, right. I believe it's with Nawazuddin. Uh huh. Well, good gracious. I believe. Dang, uh, we, we, we saw that. the trailer for it. Yeah, we gotta watch that. If I, if I forgot that. But I don't know if there's like, should we go back to one of her classics? Uh, I'm sure there's 50 films of hers you'll tell us we need to see, but. What what do we really need to see uh, next? Yeah, what should be the... She wasn't in um, that India one, the Mother India, right? I don't, I don't think she's in Mother India. Uh, I'm trying to... I'm going down her... Mr. India. She's in that's Mr. It, Mr. India. India. I was like, there's, there's one with India and the name. That's another thing I wonder. In America, child actors typically do not translate well into adult acting for a number of reasons. They typically get screwed up growing up and then just crash and burn, or they were cute little kids who actually weren't very good actors, so they don't get roles later on in life, or they just leave the industry. What's the, how many actors do what Sri Devi did in India film? Do you get a lot of people that come, because we haven't heard anybody that I can think of other than Sri Devi, who started as a kid mm -hmm. and kept going. I who else has done that? I'm talking about that. He was really young, but he wasn't a kid. Yeah, he wasn't a kid. No, he was... Yeah. No, wasn't it? Was he ever a kid? Oh. <laughs> I think Big B was born saying... No. Number one. He's like Michael Caine. He's just... <laughs> yeah, he's been he's perpetually just, old his entire it's career. It's true. His entire <laughs> But, uh, yes. We love Shri Devi. We love yes. you. We miss you, Shri Devi. And let us know what we should watch at first. Thank you!